Timberline Lodge is completely unique. There isn't a structure anywhere in the country that uh, is like Timberline. Sarah Monroe's interest in Timberline Lodge sparked 50 years ago. As a volunteer for the Junior League of Portland, she collected art and history. She eventually had enough material to write Timberline Lodge, the history, art, and craft of an American icon. The size of the building, its architecture, and the outstanding art, and the furnishings, um, all of which were made for the lodge, are unparalleled anywhere. The hotel was built between 1936 to 1938 as a works project administration project. One of the New Deal initiatives from President Franklin D. Roosevelt during the Great Depression, providing jobs for unemployed workers. The Oregon Historical Society says this boost to the local economy allowed Oregonians to master new trades. These were just average, ordinary Oregonians and Americans who suddenly became carpenters and builders and masons and designers. And it's an amazing story of how, of how it was built. Timberline Lodge became a national landmark in December 1977, a place of memories for many. Go there for family vacations, for, for skiing, to see the beautiful Mount Hood, uh, to experience, uh, you know, all that is Oregon, the greenness and the beauty of Oregon. Not just people from Oregon, but, but around the country and around the world. The Oregon Historical Society says about 2 million people visit the ski resort each year. Many who are fans of the famous movie, The Shining, which features the exterior of Timberline Lodge. Kerry Timchuk says he's glad the damage from the fire wasn't worse. So relieved that it looks like just minimal damage was done and that this national treasure will be, will be restored to its, uh, its beauty. Our viewers even had some fun memories at Timberline Lodge. Take a look at this photo from February 2021. Marianne sent this in and says it was right after the big ice storm. Or this photo from Elizabeth Anderson, who learned to ski at the resort and says it's one of her favorite places on Earth. David, back to you. I love it, and I'm so glad it is still standing in the tag so people can continue to make more memories. Thank you, Sydney. Stay with KTN.